Over the Ledge is brought to you by Ineptitude, a new masterclass taught by Greg Abbott. It's time to go Over the Ledge, the number one political comedy show exposing the shenanigans of the Texas legislature. With your host, Stephanie Chiarello. And I'm the goddess of liberty. Hello and welcome to Over the Ledge. I'm your host, Stephanie and Chiarello. I'm the goddess and of this liberty. And my co-host, the goddess of liberty. Hey. You can call me Henrietta. Let's talk about what's up with Hi. Texas hey. this week. Hi. <laughs> hey. Stephanie, did you hear that the judge in Galveston County, Mark Henry, issued an executive order on Friday that prohibited the requirement of face masks at polling places saying that every eligible voter should be able to vote whether they have a mask or not. My friend, Mike Nutter, the local nudist, he was all, this is so not fair because he got turned away from the polls for showing up with a mask but not wearing anything else except his boots. This is Texas, y'all. Attorney General Ken Paxton sent a letter statewide to every county election official warning them against encouraging voters to use the option of curbside voting. In response, Charles Butts, the billionaire who owns HEB, sent a heavily worded text to Ken Paxton that said, hands off a curbside. Also, your order will be ready shortly. Please stay in your car while we bring it out. Okay. <laughs> Entomologists? No. All right. Epidemiologists. Entom in Entomediologists? Epidermis? Epidemiologists. Epimediologists. Doctors have called Texas's recent uptick in COVID infections a warning sign, which is kind of like you're surrounded by a pack of wolves when you're camping and you call it adorable and then see if you can get a selfie. I don't even know what a selfie is. Well, I know what some selfies are. <laughs> 1888. Houston ISD, the largest ISD in Texas, lost almost 13,000 students in annual enrollment due to the coronavirus and parents keeping their children at home this year. That's almost 6% fewer students enrolled in school in Houston than in previous years. In completely unrelated news, Dave and Busters is opening 78 new locations in Houston. Public health officials said there were more than 4,100 people hospitalized in Texas with the coronavirus last Wednesday, which is like our highest total in more than six weeks. Public health officials are saying that this recent uptick is probably due to like several factors, uh, one of which is pandemic fatigue, and then the other is probably due to like this expanded reopening especially of bars which like what the hell is happening at bars i mean how much are people spitting at each other in bars because it's like maybe i was just doing it wrong the whole time no wonder i'm single i wasn't saying enough b words when i was at bars the largest counties in texas reported more than 1 million voters showing up the first few days of early voting almost 11 percent of eligible texans in texas voted those first few days in response governor abbott shut down all polling locations in large counties and moved every single one to loving county population 134. i guess i'm gonna have to wear diapers adult diapers because i'm going and I'm voting, and so are you. With the Texas House Democrats just nine seats away from a majority in the lower chamber, they raised $6.7 million in this last quarter, which is more than the $5.3 million that the Republicans earned. That's like $12 million total. Do you know what we could do with $12 million if we had campaign finance reform? It's like, Maybe we could buy Dan Patrick a heart and Governor Greg Abbott some courage. And you know what? Let's just throw him in a brain for Briscoe Kane because he's such a nice guy. And finally, Attorney General Ken Paxton said that he is now investigating two of his senior staff who last week accused him of bribery. 
So it's nice to see that the I know I am, but what are you defense still holds up in 2020. I'm, I'm rubber, rubber and you're, you're glue. It bounces on me and stuck on you. That's all we got this week. I'm Stephanie. And I'm the goddess of liberty. And this, this is, is Over, over the, the Ledge. ledge. Join us, Please on join us Friday, on Friday where, where we will have a clever and funny and video for your enjoyment. And Thanks I'll be so back much. next Tuesday. I'm gonna go grab a drink, Stephanie. Okay, one drink.